doing these clinics, riding with friends, talking to friends who are trainers, you know, getting advice. There are times that I'll have a session in the round pen with someone who I work with. Maxime and I had a session the other day and videoed it and I'm watching it and I'm going, there's something about this that I don't like. So you know what? I sent you down to Florida. Joyce, check my homework. Joyce Lewis is a phenomenal horsewoman who's retired. Yeah. She's done. She has tapped out. She is where Mark wishes I would be. Yeah. <laughs> and has moved to Florida and living the life with her husband and bless her. But the equestrian community has lost an asset in her doing so because she's a freaking genius. Wow. And I'll fight anybody who says otherwise. Everything that I do physically, not everything I've learned, but everything that I do physically, and most of the things that I, I say come from my time with her. And I just value it so much. So to be able to take that and pass it on to you, and pass it on to you, and pass it on to, to you or to anyone else who needs it, and give some of that confidence as a gift is huge. Mm -hmm. It's huge. It's more happiness in giving than receiving. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Indeed. <laughs> Indeed. And then you may turn around and share that with someone else and help them. You know, it's that's what this is about. I'm not going to hoard it. Why would I? That's just selfish. That's, that's gross. It's not, that's not who I am. And it's not what we're about here. And it's such a, like, it makes me feel good to be able to give you that confidence. Mm -hmm. You know, to see you ride it. See you owning these horses. I mean, it's, it's yeah, that's crazy. You know, you're you own a wild Mustang for crying out loud. <laughs> yeah. right? I mean, that's crazy. She's gentle. Yeah. <laughs> and two years ago, I was running around in the wild, yeah, right? That's true. Yeah. yeah that's I mean, and look amazing. how far you've come. You're saddling up and taking off and going and riding the trail by yourself. And when you came back the other day, how'd it go? Oh, it went fine. She's a little fast coming back. We're going back out. And I went, yes. Yeah, you are. Because she came back a little hot. Well, and we're not doing that. She's not allowed to be barn seller. Correct. <laughs> but would you have had the confidence to do that a few months ago? Would you have had the confidence to just take off in the woods by yourself? Maybe not. Definitely oh, yeah. not. I wouldn't I've have gone by not. myself, no. Right, but you are now. It's all about progression, right? And getting better. And like I told you when you first got here. You are not in competition with anybody at this bar, mm -hmm. with any other rider anywhere. Mm -hmm. The only competition is the owner and the rider that you were yesterday. And we've mm -hmm. had that conversation a few different times. Yeah. Because you you did used to compare yourself all the time or say, well, you know, this person or that person or this thing or that thing. Mm -hmm. It's about you and June. Mm -hmm. yeah. It's about you and June. I've seen you grow so much. And you haven't even been here that long. <laughs> yeah. Right? And it's Stop awesome. <laughs> We cry. Yeah, we do. Yeah. Sometimes we yell. Yeah. Sometimes right? we say cuss words. She yells. Yes. She I yells. do. I yell. I've yelled before. Yeah. Usually when she tries to quit. Like, the hell you are! So then we cry, cuss, and yell. Correct. All yeah. at once. Yeah. The trifecta. But it's good. It's, it's great to see not just how committed you are to your horse, but how committed you are to yourself mm -hmm. and to watch you grow, too. It's mm -hmm. been really cool. Yep. Really Thanks, cool. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Well, I mean, I've learned from all of y'all. I, I just appreciate I mean, I remember my first week here, I met Christy and met Colleen. Colleen was getting on Chief to go around the trail. And I was just like, I just can't wait to learn from all of y'all. And really um, you were even saying, you were like, well, I don't know it all, but you know, I'm happy to pass along the knowledge of what I know. But I mean, in my eyes, I was like, oh my God, this feels amazing. She's like, riding the horse along by herself, like on the trail. And you were out here like every day that I was out here. This is, and then she moved so here. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> and, then she she here. Story, yeah. and now they're stuck with me. I'm never leaving. Like Aww. this is just like, you know, I know. this if is you, beautiful. If they would build more small houses, we'd all I would here. love to build tiny <laughs> houses for all my We just need to take over. <laughs> <little houses. laughs> totally. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank you for saying that. But no, it's, and it's beautiful to see the work that you're doing with her and how you're growing and and your horse, and like I shared uh, before you sat down with us, is that I love just watching people interact with the horse. Yeah. I just love watching, and I learn, yeah. you know, and, and you're, you're brave and courageous in each one of you, and, and the Mustang. Yeah. I mean, that's not something I would ever, I mean, to me, you know, and you're doing it. <laughs> like, so it's, cool. it's so cool. 
It's awesome. Mm -hmm. I love that you're doing it here. We've always wanted a Mustang. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's, and it's great to, it, and we build off each other. Yeah. You know, the confidence totally. that you build helps me, mm -hmm. opens my eyes to say, well, maybe the next horse could be a Mustang. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't know. You know? Or a Ronald. Hmm. You know, a little naughty's a little nice. Come yeah. on. <laughs> but we know what they're capable of doing. Yes. We know that they're capable of doing it at any time. Right. Yes. So at least with with the program that, that I do, mm -hmm. that's why it takes as long as it takes. Mm -hmm. And it's hard until it's not. Mm -hmm. And you always go back to basics mm -hmm. when the shit hits the fan. Yep. Because yep. it's not if, yeah. it's, it's when. when. Yeah. Yeah. It's when. They're all going to have bad days. They're all going to get feisty. They're all going to get ticked off that you took them from their herd. You know, it's, mm -hmm. you don't know what the reaction will be. It could be a plastic bag. It could be a deer. It could be a horse calling to them from across the road. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. It could just be that it's cold and windy. Yeah. Or yeah. that a leaf came down from a That's tree right. over there. Uh -huh. yeah. So <laughs> when and if that happens and you're in the trail, mm -hmm. you have to know whether you're going to bring the head around whether you're gonna get off and move their feet, whether you're just gonna kind of do serpentines, or whether you're gonna ignore it and just keep riding and say, smarten up, let's go. Mm -hmm. You know, the only way to get that mm -hmm. is to build it, yeah. is, is the repetition, is to lay the groundwork, to have that solid foundation, mm -hmm. and to know what to do in that situation, yep. yeah. like you did. Yep. Great stuff. Well, and every wild horse is a domesticated horse, and every domesticated horse is a wild horse. Yeah, yeah. they've all got a dinner. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Which adds to the challenge and the variety, and, and it, there's never going to be a dull moment. No, there really isn't. Mm -hmm. when, you, when you get to your horse, you have to be on horse time. Yeah. And the, the key of never quitting, combined with being able to have the wisdom to throw out the agenda. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, it takes as long as it takes. It's really a balancing act of all of those things. Mm -hmm. yeah. Because maybe I need to recognize that not quitting means I'm changing what I plan. Right, right. It could so, just be a bad day. Right. And you decide not to get off. Like she it. said, yes. sometimes you got to go back to the basics. Yes. Yep. And remind yep. them. Yep. Toss your agenda. I'm just going to go out on trail today. Whoop, whoop. All that stuff gone because yeah. I got what I got today. Yeah. That was something that I really had to learn and I learned that from you, Liz. Because oh. there was one day that June was like really fresh and she was like, rearing up when we were doing groundwork and it's like oh god I really wanted to ride her today and I ran into you at the gate and you were like you know what some days you just have to do groundwork and that's completely fine just like read the situation and there's no shame in not getting on your horse yeah I'm glad that helped you yeah. yeah. You are full of like. The I know, most right? We're never yes. letting her leave. No, <laughs> no. She is like the most encouraging. She has like yeah. the best words of encouragement. Yes. And I just, I so appreciate it. Yeah. You're welcome. Yeah. You're this welcome. is so good for me to know. Like, right. Because I'm new, you know. Well, that's I mean? why I wanted you here. Yeah, because it's good to hear. Yeah. yeah. Really good. If you're ever feeling really down on yourself, talk to me. Yeah. <laughs> yes, if you ever amen. feel like quitting, call me. I'll yell at you. Oh, right. yeah. <laughs> I'll cuss. <laughs> and we'll both shout. Yeah, for sure. But you'll be encouraged. <laughs> but to have this, to know that you didn't just buy a horse. Yeah. You kind of bought a family along with it. Right. And that if you need help or you need encouragement or even when you get into the saddle and you need someone to ride with mm -hmm. or you know a few someone's to ride with and give you that confidence you have it yeah mm -hmm. that's great